If ever there was a time for the world to see a bulletproof black man, it's certainly now. On September 30th, Netflix will debut its new series, Luke Cage, based on Marvel's superhero of the same name. And in the wake of the recent fatal police shootings of African-American men across the country, the show is definitely right on time. This is the culmination of all the various experiences I've had on every show that I've ever worked on, whether it's been writing something like Southland, whether it's co-writing you know, a movie like Notorious. Yeah. Every single experience that I've had has kind of gotten poured into this. And this is definitely the most gratifying. Mike Coulter, who was first introduced as Cage on Netflix's Jessica Jones, says the positive message, coupled with playing a kick-ass comic book character, has been a dream come true. It's, it's great. You know, you go to the airports and people are, you know, they want to they wanna embrace you. They want to, you know, take selfies. You know, it's it's them showing their, their love and support. So um, I, 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 I embrace it. But unlike the 70s comic book version, Cage is on a mission to save Harlem, and there are a few forces of evil standing in his way. I run a, a club called um, Harlem's Paradise, and I'm involved in some illegitimate business, and she is trying to legitimize the business. And it's a little bit of a complicated relationship at times because we don't see eye to eye on how to move forward. Everybody wants to be the king. Cornell is doing business the way men of color had to do business back in the day, the way we did before there was opportunity. And mm. so she's saying, okay, this is time, this is when we expand. Real power now is in politics, is in running the whole city. And while Ali, who plays Cotton Mouth, will serve as one of Cage's fiercest adversaries, his club will also provide the show with an A-list musical lineup, including Raphael Sadiq, Faith Evans, and Jadena. Music is really, it's an, an integral part of black culture, and at the same time, is what gives this show a pulse and a rhythm. Luke Cage debuts on Netflix September 30th. For HipHollywood.com, I'm Jasmine Simpkins.